Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Naisha if you're new here. And in today's video, we are doing another unboxing. It is my Tribe Beauty box. So if you're new here, again, my name is Naisha. I am a subscription box lover. I have the Boxycharm Base Box and Boxy Lux. I have Boxy Premium. I have Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. And we have added a new box to the repertoire. It is the Tribe Beauty Box. I love that you can pay a small price and you get to try all these different brands all these different products and it's usually three four times the value of whatever you pay monthly if you are a makeup enthusiast and lover and hoarder like i am i love these subscription services so i wanted to try out some others every now and then i'll try a new subscription see if i like it maybe get a couple boxes and see if they can hook me like boxycharm and ipsy did side note you guys heard the drama that they are now merged into one they're still going to be operating as separate entities under one umbrella company but basically ipsy which is worth 800 million bought boxycharm for 500 million dollars that's where my money's going most of that money is mine anyway i digress as usual so today we are going to be adding another box to the repertoire, the Tribe Beauty box. So from what I know about this box, I'm just going off the top of my head here. I know it is by a woman of color. I believe she's European. And it is a bi-monthly box. It's $34.99 bi-monthly box. So this box that I have is the October-November box. So I won't be getting another one until December. So I'm going to try it out for like three boxes. Let's see what we get. See if we like it. See if we're going to continue or if we're going to move on and try something else. Spoiler alert. I did get another box, but that won't be until we start the November unboxings. So we'll talk about that then. I already know I have a problem. You don't need to tell me. So let's jump into what I got in my October slash November Trap Beauty box. So this box does come with a card. It tells you all the products that are in here. And I think it lists all of the products, maybe if you get it or not, or if it's a variant. So just based on whatever is in there, I'll read it off of the card. Okay, so the first thing I see is this Earth Harbor Helios Anti-Pollution Youth Ampoule. Ampoule? Is it ampoule? Is it ampoule? This is the bottle. This is what it looks like. It's basically a serum look at how pretty this is it has like a little squeezy oh yes i love serums love 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 serums it's a little bit on the oily side but it's absorbing into the skin gives it a nice glow it absorbed all the way in doesn't feel oily at all has a nice smell floral okay so let's see what this does this is the earth harbor helios anti-pollution youth ampoule or ampoule you let me know what it, how it's pronounced 48 dollars you guys know skincare is expensive that's why i like getting it in these boxes so helios worship helios worships your face by renewing skin through stem cell technology fancy while restoring depleted antioxidants, normalizing skin pH, smoothing fine lines and wrinkles, and enveloping you in a sensual ritual with her velvety consistency and citrus blossom aroma. Sounds amazing. Cannot wait to add that to my skincare routine. I probably will add it at night you know, for that added moisture to soak in overnight. But uh, yeah, excited to try that. I've never tried that this Helios brand before. And again, this looks so pretty. I'm probably gonna put this in my bathroom right now because it matches my decor. I have my tray with my skincare and for some reason all my skincare is in like in pink bottles. So this is gonna fit in very nicely for me to use tonight. Okay, well as you can see, this is why I love subscription boxes because we have a $48 product and I pay $34.99 for the box. And actually, this particular box I paid $24.99 because you know me, there was a sale and there was a $10 off code. So I got this first box for $24.99. Not bad at all. 
Next thing in the box is this Gerard Cosmetics Clean Canvas Eye Concealer and Base. I'm always here for a good eye base if it makes your shadows stay and not crease. Okay, so this one is in the color Fair. So they don't have a, at least I haven't done it yet, um, a survey so you can tell them like what your skin tone is. And I haven't done it yet, so this is the color. It's pretty light. I think this will actually be pretty perfect for like cut creases. I've seen a couple of people use this. I know um, Aniela Kanikvis uses it a lot. She likes it. And Glam with Suzanne uses it a lot. It's very thick. I wonder if it's like the P. Louise base that everyone's obsessed with. I've never used the P. Louise base, so I couldn't tell if it was good or not. But this is very thick. I think this will be perfect for cut creases. Oh, wow. And it's drying down matte. And it's not like thick and annoying like some pot, you know, concealers or bases are. So that's good. I'm excited to try this. I, have I ever tried anything from Gerard Cosmetics? You know what? I did get something. I got a black liquid liner which is the bane of my existence because I get those in almost every subscription box. Luckily, I haven't been getting them in the past couple of boxes, so I think they heard me complain long enough. Um, but I got that and I think I gave it away. Maybe it wasn't a giveaway or something, so I never actually used it. But I am excited to try this out, so I will be using this. And the Gerard Cosmetics Clean Canvas Eye Concealer and Base, $22. Uh, this base makes the perfect canvas for your eyeshadow art while minimizing the appearance of eyelid lines and increasing the wear time of any eyeshadow. Alright, we'll hold you to that and we'll see how it looks. We'll try it out. Alright, so now that we have the eyeshadow base, now we have the Pure Defense Eyeshadow Palette. I think this came out pretty recently from Pure. I know they've been going crazy with the releases because I guess all the things were uh, backed up because of the pandemic so they were just like every other week was a different release I think this one came out right after the pure and our beauty Christy palette which I'm so mad I didn't get but I heard it was so much drama to get it anyway but still I'm mad that I didn't get it anyway so this is what the outside of the palette looks like you can see it looks like you see the smoke that's pretty cool and then these are the colors, a very neutral, cool tone palette, a nice mix of mattes and shimmers. I have a, I have several uh, pure, and I've tried several, several pure cosmetics palettes. I'm, I'm okay with their formula. It's nice, and no complaints. Uh, there's a lot of fallout sometimes, but it's not bad. I have a lot of their palettes. I like it. I use it. I have the Barbie palette. I've had the festival palettes that I've decluttered. I have the Sweet 16 palette. I have, I've used like so many of their palettes and you know what? I'm, I don't mind the formula. Not my favorite, but I don't mind it. This is a nice neutral palette. Will be good for some nice neutral looks. The shimmers will be really good for like holiday looks coming up. So maybe I'll do a holiday look with this. If you guys are interested in seeing that, let me know in the comments. But you guys know me, I'm always excited to receive palettes in these subscription boxes because I love eyeshadow. And the Pure Cosmetics Defense Anti-Pollution Palette retails for $34. Showcase your inner artist with Defense, a highly pigmented smoky palette featuring 12 bold shades that instantly bring attention to any makeup look. Definitely agree, nice bold smoky uh, colors that will be perfect for like smoky eye, holiday, sitting in your living room for Thanksgiving. Speaking of which, I'm going to be doing some Thanksgiving looks coming up, so stay tuned. All right, so the next thing in the box is the LA Splash Cosmetics Lumos Liquid Metals. Let's see what that is in the color Potion. Okay, so this seems to be like a double-ended liner on this end. Oh, it's like a glitter liner. Let's see. Ooh, it's like a glitter liner, nice topper, that's pretty, seems to be like a tiny little bottle though. And on the other end, I was just saying, 
that I haven't gotten a black liner in a while because they hurt me. But I guess because this is a new subscription, they don't know yet that I don't need any more black liners. This one's pretty fat though. It's very thick. I wonder how the lines are gonna look. I really like the uh, shimmery side. So you know what, we'll give it a try. We'll do a look with the palette. We'll use it all together. We'll see how it looks. We'll see how I like it. You never know, it might be the best line I ever used. That's the thing about these boxes. You try things you never would have bought. So the LA Splash Lumos Liquid Metals Duo Jumbo Felt Tip Liner and Cut Crease Definer. Oh, so it's like the when you put the glitter like at the top of your cut crease. Oh, basically just a glitter liner. You do that line with glitter liner, so cut crease definer. Anyway, and that retails for $18. Pretty pricey for that. Well, I guess it's the glitter on one side, the liner on the other side. Eh, not bad. All in one, an all in one duo eyeliner that can be used to create an array of looks. A buildable water-based liner that contains super fine glitters in a clear base that dries down quickly and stays put with zero fallout. We like the sound of that. Okay, and the last thing in the box is this Suva Beauty Glossy Lamination Liquid Lipstick. Glossy Lamination. See, when you hear liquid lipstick, you're thinking it's going to be matte. Then you hear glossy, so it gets confusing. This is a pretty color. This is not a color that I wear or see often. The color is called Illusionist. Let's give it a little smudge. So it does have a glossy look to it. We'll see if it dries down matte since it's supposed to be a liquid lipstick. But you know what? Not all liquid lipsticks have to be matte. It could be glossy. It's just a liquid form of a lipstick. So let me stop talking out of my behind. Anyway, the Suva Beauty Illusionist Liquid Lipstick, which is $18. Uh, the Glossy Lamination Liquid Lipstick is formulated to deliver a punch of opaque color and comfortable flexibility. Yeah, so I'm definitely thinking it's not going to dry down all the way matte, which I don't mind. I've been glossy. I've been going glossy for the longest while. Somehow, like, I just don't even like the look of matte anymore. Even, like, with my face, I prefer to have, like, a glowy look to it. So, you never know. Maybe I'll go back to my matte days. But for now, we are glowing. All right, so I did the math and everything in the box has a value of $140. So, like I always ask, you let me know. I pay $24.99 for the box, but generally it's $34.99. The value is $140. I think it's well worth it because I actually like everything that's in the box and I wanna try everything that's in the box and that rarely happens. So, I think it's definitely worth it, but you let me know down in the comments, do you think this box is worth the $35.99 every two months? And then we'll see if it'll st how long it's gonna stick around. Okay, so if you're not new to my channel, you know that normally when I do all my unboxings, there's always a product or two that I don't like, I already have one, not going to use it and i tend to put it into my monthly giveaway my monthly giveaway is running a little bit late this month because i just got in my tribe beauty box i ordered it in the middle of october so i just got it uh, closer to the end uh so that's why you're now seeing it and unfortunately i kind of like everything that's in the box so none of this is going to be going into the giveaway so i'm just going to reiterate the things that are going to be in the giveaway and you know i know maybe i put in a couple of extra goodies so before i get into that i'm gonna let you guys know again in order to enter the giveaway all the instructions are down below all you have to do is to be subscribed to my channel like this video and any of my other videos throughout the month comment give it a thumbs up and you get extra points for following me on facebook or instagram and liking and commenting over there as well so my supporters the ones who i see are really supporting always get a cute little gift from me every month so let's talk about what we have in this month's giveaway so this is our little baggie the first thing that we have that came out of my ipsy bag is the dr brent port dermabrasion pore perfecting exfoliator 
comes in this beautiful blue packaging it is full size and this i believe is like 58 dollars then we have the laura geller and 50 kisses lip locking liquid color in ruby romance a beautiful liquid lipstick strawberry color this was in one of my boxy charms everything here is brand new untouched unswatched of course and then we have this spun gel cherry tonka musk body wash infused buffer so this is one of those multi-use body washes that already has body scrubbers that already has a body wash in it so you just wet it and lather it up and it's in cherry tonka musk okay so that was pretty much it so i added a couple things so i'm going to add the hank and henry slick with it eyeliner in blackity black it is a long wear liquid eyeliner like i literally just mentioned I have a lot of these that I get through subscription boxes. I'm never going to get through all of them. I'm sure there will be someone else who will love a liquid liner. And I've never tried this Hank and Henry one and I really wanted to try it. But it's brand new, sealed, unused. So I want to make sure it was one that was sealed. And it's a nice black and I heard it's a really, really good liner. So this one's going to go into our October giveaway. Next, I'm going to include this purple liner from starlo cosmetics so it's one of those water activated liners in this beautiful purple you can't really see it's more of a lavender purple color so i bought a set of five or six from starlo cosmetics and a bunch of pastel colors but i also got a mystery box from OM omfg cosmetics and i wasn't paying attention i actually ordered the same color so now i have two of them that are basically exactly the same color and I don't really use these liners a lot so I don't need to so since I have more of the Starlo Cosmetics and I can try that formula and I only have the one of the OMFG I'll keep this one and I will put the Starlo Cosmetics one into the giveaway I believe these are have a value of like $15.99 each and then lastly I'm gonna throw in a palette you guys know I'm obsessed with palettes and this is the BH Cosmetics Fairy Lights 20 color eyeshadow palette. I love BH Cosmetics. Their formula is really, really nice. I have a ton of their palettes. So this is what it looks like. A pretty nice, cool, neutral palette with some pops of pinks and blues. You can get a lot of nice neutral looks out of this with the golds and the uh, neutral shimmers. But you can also do a pink look. You can do a blue look. I think it's a really, really versatile palette. And this is one of their holiday palettes that I picked up at Ulta a while ago. So this is also going to be going into this month's giveaway. If you guys like eyeshadow as much as I do, I think this will be a really, really nice one. And again, all brand new, unswatched, untouched. So again, if you're interested in, in entering the giveaway, the instructions are down below. It's really easy and yeah good luck to everybody that enters and you know hopefully you win and yeah that's pretty much it that's all i have that's everything that i got in my tribe beauty box again let me know what you think about the box down below is it a keeper or not and then again there's another one that we added to november or is it a re-add lots of interesting things happening <laughs> So again, thank you guys so much for watching all the way to the end. Good luck in the giveaway. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.